Hello! Today I want to share with you the three most common mistakes when creating a custom email template. Besides the fact that marketing is one of the most important things in our business, most of the people are visual consumers and that's why we all want to send beautiful emails to our audience within our email marketing campaigns. But that also leads to make some mistakes while designing the email templates and I want to share some of them with you. The first thing to avoid is using images instead of text all the time. When you try to load too many images in one email template, it could cause loading issues. And for example, email clients like Outlook will ask you to approve to load these images because it doesn't load them automatically. And it often could happen users are leaving the, the email or just deleting it. So that's not something which you're trying to achieve. Uh, so try to combine the images with text and make it again look clean and simple. And one more thing to avoid is don't, don't just use big, big image file sizes. Second thing is separate creating an email template and creating a website template. Website templates are loaded in the browsers which are much more sophisticated than email templates which are loaded in email clients. For example, if you're trying to create some fancy elements, it's much easier to create it for presenting on a website than presenting on email templates. So my advice here is just do a lot of testing before launching your campaigns because it's much possible to do some elements which are not actually supported everywhere and you have to detect that before send it to your audience. The third thing is not using a mobile first approach while designing your email templates. What I mean with that is on mobiles you have very limited space to present the most important information which is not the case with laptops and desktops. So when you do the design just think about how do you want that design to be presented on a mobile phones and then just scale it to desktops and laptops. I will show you two examples to see how a bad example and a good example looks like. Also, more than 40% of female users open it on mobile. So I always suggest adopting the mobile first approach for template design. This requires different element placements, which optimizes the message for mobile, which you can then easily recreate it for laptops and desktops. I really hope that you will never make any of these three most common mistakes when creating your next email templates, but if you need any help, just feel free to reach out. And if you like this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and you can also join to our Facebook group where we discuss SEO and web related things. See ya.